We initiated a brand new master plan. Uh, we do one about every 10 years. Uh, there's a lot that happens over the span of a decade. So the last time we did our plan back in 2013, the sports complex was still a dream. We hadn't renovated and completely replaced Soldiers Creek Park. Parks like the one we're standing in were still in the dream phase of what it is we'd like to have done here. There are other things that have happened in the parks and recreation world that we really didn't even know about 10 years ago, and I'll use pickleball as an example. Uh, that's a real big trend right now um, in recreation. Most importantly is really understanding how uh, life in Seminole County may have changed over the last 10 years. We need to make sure we're accounting for all of those new residents that have come in um, and make sure that we're providing a good level of service for them as well. As we go through the process, we've got surveys, we've got the one-on-ones, any and all comments about where the folks believe we need to go as a parks and recreation system, that's what we're looking for at this point. Part of the idea of this master plan is to help provide a good roadmap going forward that touches on what are the priorities for our overall system, what do we think we can get done, and how much is it going to cost.